Hello everybody, I'm Peter Globe, and today I'm gonna be ranking Universe 2 Fighters. Yay! Uh, this is gonna be an angry review uh, and ranting mostly on their fighters. Keep in mind, Universe fi 2 Fighters are more confusing than ranking Universe 3 Fighters, so it's, this is gonna be just a random list to be fair. Oh, well, that's who I hate last, to be fair, more, if I'm honest. Number 10. We're Brian. Her design is trash. Her lights are trash. Her motif is trash. She is trash. Nothing else. She is just a big pile of trash. That's being nice to her. And I'm not gonna spend another second talking about this fucking piece of trash. Number nine. Pran. This was one of the two fires that were hitting. This was one of the two fires that could possibly be, I don't know, have some kind of things they can defeat. They can even match maybe Gohan. Ow. It's that when we get an ugly pile of sludge that its only contrib contribution to the team was deflecting energy attacks. Yeah, but Tamo is more useful than this guy. He is just a big pile of trash. Smaller one than Rebrand, but that's just because of his lack of screen time. Seriously, this guy is just terrible. What even is the purpose of him? So this other fighters can, you know, you know, hold their own if one won, but this guy can't even do that. Seriously, I'm pretty sure every single fighter can take this guy out. I don't know where he was hiding. Although I am wondering how, what was the technology in case if that tournament field didn't break. Seriously, I mean, I'm pretty sure that's the only way that thing could actually work. Also, his spinning the kids also up remind me of all those terrible cartoons that try to make make stuff gross and think that that'd be good. Seriously, this is just terrible. Number eight, Zerloin. He barely got any screen time, and this the other one's got something. This guy ba guy get barely anything. He was wearing Rebrand's outfit, which is, again, trash. And he was just a terrible character. I don't need to go on. I don't think I need to go on with anyone in this. Hey, this guy's just forgettable, to be fair. I mean, even by the father's standards, he was forgettable. I mean, I can just remember a couple of years of 10 fires. I can remember well, one thing this guy did, except at the end. Which was, again... Completely pointless and trash. Number seven. Zarbuto. Here we have a race we probably wanted to see more. Wanted to find out more about them. I mean, how do they operate? How that? I mean, and what? how is their intelligence? But instead, we get a stupid guy who doesn't even know how to put on earrings. Who is just a moron. Remind me what was his purpose again? Seriously, this guy's just trash and completely pointless. Seriously, I mean, I could pretty much say they just want to give him something. I mean, I think it would be much better if they actually, you know, just made this guy and just make him a completely different race. So it's completely pointless to have him. I think they actually actually did something. This guy did nothing. Number six. So, she is the reason why we just didn't want to fall off the states. So, yeah, she is trashy design. She's completely pointless and, oh my god, she looks terrible. Seriously, why did she even stay at tournament for so long? She's completely pointless. There's nothing with her. 
I mean, why they even had her? I mean, they could actually have her get an awesome battle with Piccolo, but no, they had to get her one shot by 17, because honestly, I can't even believe she didn't get one shot before. Number 5. Harmira. Well, his design is somewhat cool, his laser face is somewhat uh, exciting. Hey, so Sniper Finn is pretty, gimmick is pretty good, and I guess we can get something out of him. More than other characters who are just forgettable, stupid, and blank. I mean, he at least, you know, was somewhat around the exa powerful Paula ex being the tournament. I like Chris Park and Brad, but again, it's not something I can say. And he nearly got, uh, uh, you know, a very awesome, some, that, Awesome defeat where he, you know, shows that his honor when he gets defeated. But again, they just run that because the universe was just shitty. Number four, Barbara. Scary cat, then he showed to have actually some fun, but after that, nothing. He is just a moron, nothing else. I mean, he was somewhat thing, but nah, nothing really else. He is just a trashy character. I can't say more, because he is nothing. Seriously, I mean, I mean at least the honest guy was actually somewhat realistic. Which is good to point out the flaws. Number three. Vical. Uh, she was probably, she's probably the only one that actually shows... How a flying character in a tournament of power is useful, so I'm gonna give her a pass. Nothing else really I can say about her because nothing really is she's shown. Number two. Jimmy's. Well, at least this, like I said, this guy at least did something. He's had somewhat of a interesting way for Goku to fight him. He is better with Gohan was alright. His battle with Frieza was awesome. He was double, but again, I mean, he's definitely not one of the worst things in that. I mean, how least they try with him. And he's shown some kind of a friend what our attraction is. Considering the fact that the only thing we knew is that they had a lot of weird techniques and they have very low power level. And that's it. I mean, maybe in the manga we'll get any explanation about uh, why they are in Universe 2, but alright. And number one is Kakunsa. Yeah, she's she are, the only one of the Kamikaze Fireballs that doesn't look terrible. The Bandit's costume on him was alright. Her battle with 17 was decent. And, well, yeah, she was just alright, a character. Not being like super angry about like everyone else, but yeah, they. But still, she's from his too, and she's shitty. And seriously. She was pretty much just there to be eliminated the first one out of the three. Which to be fair, if your one of the three of your strongest fighters can be eliminated then so early with not even the strongest five showing up, did they really think they had a bad fighting chance? I don't think so. Now I hope you liked this video. I hope you're gonna leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos in the future and with that said and I also wish you can leave your rankings on universe 2 in the comments below or just telling me which ones you you liked f from universe 2 that you didn't want to see burn in fires of hell that would be awesome good too now that's it I cannot wait to see you next time bye